day five in quarantine. So, today, went outside, sit on the porch, um, brother came by to wash some clothes, and went outside, sit on the porch, talk, trying to socially distance, talk in the fresh air, probably against the quarantine rules, not the years, but we just came from the bath for a little bit. And we sit outside and talk, and I was trying to get fresh air, but sit up here probably 30 minutes. By the time I went back in the house, I was coughing really bad. Probably spent 30 minutes coughing from trying to get some fresh air. Uh, um, this is part of the virus, coughing. So, and I felt like I was out of breath. I got up to get some tea and I was out of breath. I had to um, sit down and then I got up and was kind of a light head, so I had to lay down and rest. I was trying to get some fresh air, but fresh air seems to trigger the coughing. Um, other than that, though, so I'm getting up and feeling dizzy. Those are the symptoms um, that I'm having. Um, headache. Getting dizzy and standing up, coughing, outside in the air. Um, headache. Body aches have kind of went away. Legs kind of sore still. Um, every now and then, chest pain right in here. But I'm doing pretty good. Um, better than most people probably do with this virus. Um, the parents were feeling bad. Um, the doctor told my dad to go to the ER and get retested, and they're supposed to get some the antibody treatments. Um, so they were doing worse. Um, having more pain and stuff than me. But on Saturday now, day of quarantine, um, for Saturday plans in quarantine, do some Sudoku puzzles, um, watch Lifetime movies, there's supposed to be a movie about a cheerleader, um, killer mom, killer cheer mom or something, and then pom pom, something's supposed to be coming on with Lifetime, and Watch some movies, get some rest. Um, still drinking Gatorade and trying to eat vegetables. And um, saw a movie last night on a Lifetime about a therapist. Uh, it's like killer doctor or something. About this woman. <laughs> Who was helping this boy who was paralyzed from a car accident? His girlfriend was texting and driving, and they were got in a car accident. And, and she was helping him do therapy, and how he was gonna have surgery to try to walk again, but she goes and kills the doctor so that he won't have the surgery, so that he keeps needing her. And then they eventually end up in a relationship, and she's like 30 something years old, and he's like 18. and crazy movie and then it turns out she's like not who she says she is she has a different name and she had been in a relationship with a guy before that was in a wheelchair and she was gonna try to cut off his arms and then this guy she's looking at how to amputate his arms because she wants to get rid of the dude's arms so that he'd be more dependent on her or something yeah lifetime has some crazy movies but, um that's what I've been up to, watching Lifetime movies, nothing else to do in this quarantine life. Um, but I guess I'm handling the virus pretty well because most people, some people end up in the hospital and I didn't feel out of breath when I came back inside the house, like I said, but other than that, I haven't had no problems breathing. That's the one thing I was afraid of. 
but I haven't seemed to have any trouble. My child is doing better. Um, the doctor never did call back about the question I had about if you're allowed to go to a doctor while you have the virus. They never did call back and let me know, but I think it's clearing up. He's playing. Well, um, he wants me to get off here, so. I'll end this vlog here.